I was born and raised in Porsensberg in the Northern Cape. After school, I joined the South African Police Service. In 1991, I was involved in an accident. In the accident, I lost my right leg as well as my left hip, and now I'm wheelchair bound. Um, that same year, I was introduced into the world of the disabled, and now I manufacture wheelchairs and assistive devices in order to help them. For the past 15 years, I've been designing and manufacturing different kinds of sport wheelchairs and hand cycles. I've been competitive myself in the racing wheelchair and hand cycling division. So this is the second model of the Rural Handbike, and it actually works like this. You get onto the bike, you lock it, and then you just lift your floor. So now you stay in your own wheelchair, you can pedal from your own wheelchair, you unlock it, and you're ready to go. And this is my off-road version, 4x4 wheelchair, that you can use the fatso wheels on the beach with, and it's easy to get on and off. You just go. I've noticed a huge problem in the rural areas with mobility. The areas are not very conducive for people in wheelchairs, and I came up with the idea to manufacture and design a rural handbike that will enhance their lives and make mobility for them much easier. The bike is basically made out of three parts. We've got the front part where the handle is, we've got the center part for the frame, and then the back part for the two wheels. And then you've got your seat in the middle. One of the big advantages of this handbike is how easy it is to transfer from your wheelchair to the bike. You just hop onto the bike, and because there are no loose cables, nothing is in your way. I've kept the design very basic with no gears or extra cables that needs any maintenance. When you push forward on the handles, it creates a forward movement with a back pedal brake system. And if you need to reverse, you can just pull the handles back and press down and you can go backwards. The seat is fully adjustable and by just loosening the four bolts on the bottom here, you can adjust the seat forward and backwards to get in line with your footrest, which is also adjustable up and down, or forward or backwards. Okay, on the back, we have this small little carrier here that has a double purpose. Your wheelchair goes around, you pull it up where the back wheels fits in here and your front wheels here. And then you can also put a small little carry bag or something here. And if you've got small children, they can stand here and just stand right behind your back. So here you can see with it, with a wheelchair on the back already, and then you can just go. I do all my own welding and I do all my own fabrication of parts. In fact, I do everything. The SAP Foundation grant will help me to manufacture another 10 of the hand bikes which I would like to send into the rural areas for search and development and afterwards I would like to donate them and they will also help me to set up a manufacturing workshop where I can manufacture more assisted devices, rural handbikes and wheelchairs for people with disabilities. My accident, losing my leg and being disabled, gave me a new purpose in life, to be creative and innovative, to help others through my wheelchairs to have a better life.